Ladies and gentlemen, hello and welcome. Thank you for your interest in the North Coast Drones LED strobe light holder for DJI series drones. At the moment, uh, we've just got these for the Mavic 2, but we currently have in production uh, a whole series of light holders so that you can use our LED lights on all of your DJI drones. Now today is just going to be a quick introduction on how to use the strobe light holder and how to mount it on your Mavic 2 securely. So you may already have one of our LED strobe lights or you may be buying this uh, for the first time and in a kit. Uh, we'll run through in another video how to operate these lights uh, but today we're just going to quickly be showing you how to actually fit them to your Mavic 2. So you've got your light, pick up the little light holder. You'll notice that the three corners here have um, some sections on them to stop the light falling out. Uh, that's pretty self-explanatory. If you grab your light, push it in from the corner that doesn't have one of those big built-up areas and all you've got to do is just give it a little bit of a push and make sure that it pops under that side there on the left and then it's in there securely. So just a little light push and then you'll see it does move around a little bit in the holder. That's completely normal. Um, if they were any firmer than that, it would be physically impossible to remove. We, we went through quite a few different prototypes um, constructing these. On that note, we do design and manufacture all of these in-house. These are 3D printed uh, strobe light holders made with a PLA plastic material. So it is environmentally friendly and it is a fairly soft material too. So you aren't uh, going to be too worried about damaging your drone. We've done a lot of testing and so far um, it's good as new, these uh, beautiful new Mavic 2s. So once you've got your light in the holder, uh, it's there and ready to be used. As normal with these LED lights, just push and hold the button till you get a solid light come on, release it, and then you're in strobe mode. Again, to turn it off, just push and hold until the light flashes twice, let go, and your strobe's now off. The way we've designed these as well, uh, you can plug a charger cord in, a micro USB cable, while they're still in the holder. So you can mount these on your drone and leave them on there permanently or you can leave them uh, just in the holder if you do want to remove them from the drone. Next step is to actually mount the light onto the drone. Now these uh, particular holders are just at the moment designed for use on the back legs. The front legs are providing a little bit more of a problem because they're not as easy to work with uh, and most people from our research want to use these um, for visibility from the rear of their drone when they're flying away, which makes a lot of sense. So to get this working, you'll see, as I mentioned earlier, that there is a, um, a slight angle on these. That's so that when they're attached to the drone, uh, they're angled slightly downwards. So if you are up really high and a long way away, you've got the best chance of seeing that LED straight on. So to mount them, all you do is work out which way is going to be the angle downwards. Closer to the um, propeller, push the LED light holder up, twist it around and you'll see that it's fairly flexible there because it is narrower near the propeller. Once it's uh, securely on the arm, just push it gently towards the body of the drone and you'll see that it locks there because it does get thicker as we go up. So you can see that's fairly firm. It doesn't have to be super firm. These are designed in a way that they do have a nice little cutout there so that if in flight they do slide down, they're not going to interfere with the operation of your motor. They'll just sit there and they should not uh, fall off if that did happen either. They are still on there fairly firmly. So to remove them, simply just opposite to how you put them on, twist back around and remove from the drone like that. So again, quickly to put it on, straight up there, twist around and then push firmly towards the body of the drone and then you're ready for business. Works the same on either side. So just twist around, push up, same with this one. So now you're set up with two strobe lights on the rear of your drone and you're gonna have no problems with visibility um, as you get further away from it now. These will be super bright 
and you're going to uh, see it a lot further away than with the naked eye uh, if you didn't have lights. So quickly removing those. Now if we did want to uh, remove the light from the holder, in the kit with each holder you'll get this cool little uh, light removal tool. Now you'll notice that in the bottom of the light holder there's a hole where you can actually see the bottom of the battery. Just hold that up there. So to remove them, what I do to start with is turn it around so that um, you've got the, the corner that it's going to come out just up there. What I do is simply push that little tool into the hole, end up grabbing the light holder with the one hand, so two fingers there with your index finger on top of that holder. Now you're just going to apply a little bit of pressure to the bottom of that battery and with your other hand you're going to slightly twist to the left, so counterclockwise, so you're going to be grabbing and twisting left to the actual light itself, a bit of pressure and it's just going to pop out nice and easily. So again, that in reverse, just like that. If we want to remove it, just a little bit of pressure and twisting out like that, nice and simple. If you do have any questions, feel free to send us an email, sales at northcoastdrones.com.au or give us a call 0439 698 160. And as we said, there'll be a lot more designs coming soon uh, when we get through the development and research phase uh, for all of your DJI drones. So we look forward to your feedback.